The LJ Smith Linear Collection features stainless steel cable or tube infill options and pre-drilled and pre-cut newels. Our cable system is marine grade 316 stainless steel for lasting beauty, very low maintenance and fit for interior or exterior applications. The exclusive swageless cable fittings are simple to install and require no expensive equipment. Our linear tube system features 3 quarter inch brushed 304 stainless steel hollow tube for a very sleek and modern look. The pre-drilled and pre-cut newels are a game changer, saving hours and hours of install time. Only three tools are needed to install our linear collection cable system. Two 3 8 inch open end wrenches, a 1 8 inch cable cutter, and a 3 16 Allen wrench. Install each newel at the appropriate location on the stairway and level run, if applicable, using our newel mounting kit. Now install the handrail on top of the newel pins. Install the rake fixed fitting using the hinged portion as a lever to rotate the lag into the newel. Repeat until all fittings have been installed into the newel. On the newel at the opposite end of the frame, install the rake tensioner fitting body using the hinged portion as a lever to rotate the lag into the newel. Repeat until all fittings have been installed into the newel. Now assemble the female threaded rotating portion onto the rake tensioner fitting body just until the male threads are covered. To keep the recommended 42 inch spacing between newels, an intermediate rake newel may be placed at the midpoint. Run the cut end of the cable through the rake pass-through newel and insert the cable end into the rake fixed fitting. At the opposite end of the run, mark the cable at the score mark on the female threaded portion of the rake tensioner fitting. Cut the cable at this mark. Loosen the female threaded portion so that approximately five or six threads are showing on the male portion of the fitting and insert the cable end into the fitting. Now install the level fixed fitting using a 3 8 inch wrench to rotate the lag into the newel. Repeat until all fittings have been installed into the newel. On the newel at the opposite end of the level frame, install the level tensioner fitting body using a 3 16 inch Allen wrench to rotate the lag into the newel. Repeat until all fittings have been installed into the newel. Now assemble the female threaded rotating portion onto the level tensioner fitting body just until the male threads are covered. To keep the recommended 42 inch spacing between newels on any level run, an intermediate newel may be placed at the midpoint. Run the cut end of the cable through the level pass through newel and insert the cable end into the level fixed fitting. At the opposite end of the run, Mark the cable at the score mark on the female threaded portion of the level tensioner fitting. Cut the cable at this mark. Loosen the female threaded portion so that approximately five or six threads are showing on the male portion of the fitting and insert the cable end into the fitting. Always consult your local building codes for the desired tension on the cables. Using two 3 8 inch wrenches, tension each cable by holding the male tensioner fitting body with one 3 8 inch wrench, while using a second 3 8 inch wrench to rotate the female threaded portion of the fitting onto the male portion. Tension the cables one section at a time, starting with the bottom cable, then going to the top cable, and continue this alternating pattern until all cables have been tensioned. See how easy it is to install the LJ Smith Linear Collection Cable System?